I'm going to do a quick discussion on how to calibrate the Victron BMV 712 battery monitor uh, with your system. And basically you do a zero calibration. And how you go about that is this is the battery side of the shunt and this is the load side. So what you're going to do is remove this screw lift this wire off that prevents any load uh, from being on the batteries and uh, I did some other things I turned the inverter off it's on right now and I turned my outlets off just to make sure there was no load I also pulled the fuses and everything as well too but should be that you just have to lift the load wire right here and once you lift it you go into your program whether it's Mac or on your iPhone and you go to your little settings wheel here and battery and then you go down here and hit the calibrate button and once you hit the calibrate button it'll say do you wanna really calibrate this thing and you would hit OK now once you're done with that the system should be zeroed out I'm gonna scroll through here till I get to the load I'm pulling Z minus uh, 0.72 amps and I have a clamp on amp meter here which I should have uh, I should have removed before I did this let me turn it on here's my clamp on meter I'm gonna turn it on to amperage and it's on AC amperage right now going to change the mode to DC and you might notice that it's it's not zeroed so you hit the relative button here REL it stands for relative and that'll zero it out and then we're going to clamp on to the load side and as you can see I've got about 0.63 it's best to try to get it centered here as well as you can uh, 0.71 and up here I've got about 0 0.70 0 0.71 so my system's calibrated now it's not that difficult lift the load wire go to the software put it all back together after you calibrate it and then measure on the load side uh, with a true RMS amp meter and that'll do it.